Hi, I'm going to be showing you how I play my Sheikh Yanu off my new album, Life. Uh, Sheikh Yanu is in the key of E, and I start on that chord, except rather than play it down here, I come up and play this E5 chord up here, which is really just made up of E's and B's. Uh, just got a little bit more power to it. The way you do that is you fret up on the seventh fret, fifth string with your first finger, and you're on the ninth fret with your uh, third and fourth fingers on the third and fourth strings. And you strum everything. So I go. That second chord, it's kind of like a major seven, um, you get by pulling off your fourth finger on the third string and you put your second finger down on the eighth fret. So, so that, that it's root, root, chord, root, root, chord, root, and that's the changed chord. And then I put it back on right there. back off. So you can hear that. So my first finger and my third finger uh, just stay where they are the whole time. It's really just my second and fourth fingers switching back and forth on the third string. And now I'm going to switch to an A chord, except rather than play that down here, what I'm going to basically be doing is doing the, the six string bar chord, um, but I'm going to change my fingering. I'm going to use the same fingers, one, two, and three, uh, like, an, like an open E chord, and I'm going to leave the first, second, and sixth strings open. So you get this kind of color to it. So from the top, And I'm sort of doing this palm muting thing just to sort of accentuate some of the chord changes. If I let it ring, you wouldn't hear some of those um, color changes as well. All right, so. And just using the sort of fatty part of your palm and just sort of resting the strings on there, pulling off and pulling, putting on. to a C sharp. Now again, you could play it down here. That's fine. But um, I, I don't know. For some reason I play it up here. And the way that I do that, it's kind of like your uh, F sharp minor, if you know how to do that, or any of your other six string minor chords, barred minor chords. Except again, leaving the first, second, and sixth strings open. So I've got, to be specific, my third string on the 11th fret, fifth string, my fourth finger, 11th fret, fourth string, and my first finger is on the third string in the ninth fret. So that's your C sharp minor. So Baruch That's your C sharp. In the same way that you played the A, but you're going to be up two frets, so you're going to be up on the eighth and ninth frets like this, using that open E chord shape. So again, to be specific, fifth string, up on the ninth fret, second finger, your third finger is going to be right below it, in the ninth fret, your third finger, and your first finger is going to be on the third string in the eighth fret. <laughs> Just that E, that sort of E major seven to that A. To life and to life and to life and to life. That repeats. To life and to life and to life and to life. Now you're going up to your C 
sharp. I wanna hold on to this moment now. That's your beat. And you start all over. It was really just the verse and the chorus. That is the whole song. Thanks for watching. If you've got any questions, please feel free to uh, just ask below. Thanks. See ya.